They still are, but to take a look at this quick trip now, you'd hardly know that anything was wrong here at Truman and Bennington. The quick trip open for business, all the gas pumps being used for the $1.99 unleaded fuel that they have here. But earlier this morning, there was nothing going on here after this robbery. Let's take a look at some pictures of the scene at the time. You'll see the crime scene tape up and the police uh, squad cars that were here. This happened shortly before 3 o'clock in the morning. A man runs in. Shouts, this is a robbery. He foraged through the cash register, grabbed what money he could, and we're told by police there wouldn't have been very much money in that cash register at that time. And then he took off here. The police believe that he eventually went south on Ewing Avenue, another one of the cr cross streets here. Police still looking for him. Here's the basic description of the robber. Uh, police say he is a uh, black man, 30 to 40 years old, about six feet tall, 200 pounds or so. An officer here on the scene did describe him as heavy set, black shirt, and blue. Jeans. Now, quick trips typically have terrific, terrific uh, security systems in place. Uh, officers here telling me that they looked through the video here. It was very good video, but the guy wasn't in the store more than 25 or 30 seconds, so there wasn't much they could pick up off of that that would have been a distinguishing characteristic. That investigation wrapped up about 30 to 40 minutes ago. Again, the QT uh, open for business here, but a scary few moments earlier this morning. Reporting live, Martin Augustine, KBC 9.